everyone, it's Jack Cotton, best-selling author of Selling Luxury Homes, luxury real estate expert and speaker. It's the last day of Thanksgiving weekend, I'm here for a bike ride on my Alaskan snow bike here on the beach, and I stopped by this tree, which is basically a conch tree. People from all over, everywhere, walk by this tree and they find a conch shell on the beach and hang it on the tree, and each person has a different thought when they hang their conch on the branch, but the common thread is the beauty of this place the message it sends with all these conchs planted on the branches of this tree, and it's just a great thing to see, especially at this time of the year. Well, anyway, it got me to thinking about the recent NAR convention that just passed a couple weeks ago down in Orlando, Florida, because people from all over the world, and of course this country, came together with a common interest in the love of the real estate business. Let's face it. You have to love the real estate business to make that journey to the NAR convention. And with all the negativity, with all the <clears throat> tumult in the marketplace, the positive atmosphere that exists in this convention is so important to recharge the batteries of all of us. We get to be with each other and with our common thread of a love of the business. We get to learn new techniques and skills from the best teachers and trainers from around the world. And it's just a wonderful experience. I had two sessions there. One was on Friday. I walked into my room. There was about a thousand chairs in the room. And I thought, wow, are enough people going to come to fill this place up? And as it turned out, there was standing room only. And my people came to me from India, from South Africa, from New Zealand, and across this country. It was just a great thing to see us all come together to recharge, renew, refresh, and reinvigorate our real estate business. And it got me thinking that if every single person who came to the convention, which was a record turnout for recent years, if every single person sold one or two more houses a year, what a difference that would make to our economy. Then I got to think of that if every realtor member, whether they came to the convention or not, if every one of the million members of the National Association of Realtors sold one more house in 2013, what would that mean for our economy? What would that mean for our business? Because you know, when we sell houses, Everybody else sells washing machines, trash cans, carpet, paint. The whole retail world revolves around our ability to sell houses. Anyway, those are my thoughts on the convention. Make it a plan for 2013 to attend the convention next November in San Francisco. And also think about what you're going to do next year in 2013 to remain positive, to get positive, to be positive, to sell more real estate, to help more people realize the dream of a home in this beautiful country of ours, and the changes it can make in those people's lives, and the changes it can make in the economic life of our entire country. So I'm going to continue my ride on the beach today. Hope you all had a great Thanksgiving weekend. I know I did. And we're embarking on an exciting time of the year when we think about our plans for 2013. Make sure your plans include education, recharging, renewal, refreshing, and reinvigorating your skills as you work to attain your goals in real estate. Until next time, make it a great week.